Okay, so the first thing that we do is, okay, we get out a nice pair of scissors. Okay, be careful so you don't cut yourself. Okay, and we look on the shirt, okay, for small bits of thread, okay, like here, okay, called Irish pedants. That we need to chop off, okay, and we do that the whole way through the shirt. Things we look for, okay, is along the main seam of the shirt, okay, and anywhere where there's stitching. Just making sure all those little bits of thread have been chopped off. Can we do this the whole way through the shirt? Can just discard those. Okay, happy there. Okay, so the first thing we do, okay, is we grab our collar, okay, and place the collar so it's back. The back of the collar is flat on the ironing board. Okay, we grab our iron and press hard with loads of steam, okay, to flatten the collar. Okay, from there, we take a side of the shirt, place it over so it's nice and flat, all the way up to the stitching. So the stitching okay, runs alongside the side of the ironing board. We grab our iron again. We press the whole shirt okay, so there's no creases left in the shirt. Okay, make sure you manipulate the shirt around the iron and board, okay, so you can get all parts of the uh, of the shirt. Okay, once you've done one side, move over to the next side. Okay, once we've done the sides, put it onto its back. Okay, we pull it over again, so the seam of the back along the side is running up alongside the ironing board. Okay, we grab our iron and iron again. Okay, again, manipulate the shirt. Okay, to the other side. Okay, then we push it, put it into the middle. Okay, so we can get around the, the back of the neck area. Keep okay, iron up the back of the neck. Okay, once the sides are done, we need to do the shoulder blades and the shoulder area. So what we do is we grab the shoulder side, okay, and lay it over, ensuring okay, that the shoulder is flat on the ironing board. Grab our iron and press the shoulder blades. Okay, happy. Okay, that's the shirt then pressed. So now to move on to the collar. Okay, the collar is one of the most important parts okay, of the shirt. Okay, to press it nice and flat, okay, so it looks good. So what we do, we put the shirt on nice and flat about halfway over the ironing board. Okay, and there's an important part here, which is this seam, okay, of this uh, bit of Velcro here, the back of the seam. Okay, what happens is you put your finger across the seam, okay, and you fold 
Okay, the collar over. Okay, so the collar runs okay, along that seam with that uh, Velcro there. Pull the shirt along. Okay, it's good. we're going to press nice and high up in the collar. Okay, once you've got it nice and flat, okay, you grab your iron. Okay, we're going to press up the collar. And then this is where you need to use uh, loads of steam. Okay, a bit of water on the sides where the crease is going to be. And press. Okay, so that's one side done. You need to grab the other side. Okay, again, again, you're looking for now the um, the Velcro patch along the top of the Velcro patch. Okay, we're folding it over the top, keeping it in place, moving the shirt down so it can be pressed. Grab a iron again and press the collar. Make sure you use loads of steam, a bit of water where the crease is going to be to get a nice sharp crease. Okay, that's the collar done. Okay, I'm complete. Once you've done the collar, okay, you're going to move on to the sleeves. Okay, so first thing we do is get the sleeve nice and flat on the ironing board. Can okay, we iron it flat? Okay, once it's, we've got it flat, we pinch the bottom side and the top side, okay, and the crease is going to run, okay, straight up the top, okay, through the centre, okay, from point to point of the patch. All the way up. So there's a crease at the top of the patch, above the top of the patch, down the bottom of the patch, and on the patch, whilst ironing the pocket. Turn the sleeve over, and again we press the side again. Okay, we then do the same on the other side. Okay, and that's the shirt pressed. Okay, ensure now. The Velcro patch inside where your rank slide is going to be is all the way to the top. Okay, and you have one final check okay, that there's no creases from where you've been moving the shirt around. If there are, okay, you just bring the iron on okay, and, get, and go over them. Okay, once you're happy, okay, you're then ready to fold the sleeves.